And we also have this really scary situation on a plane headed to Logan Airport. It happened on a United Airlines flight. It was coming in for a landing on Sunday. So that's when witnesses say a passenger pulled out a makeshift weapon and tried to open an emergency door. Oscar Margain live for us at Logan Airport this morning. Oscar, we know this man is now facing several charges, but what else do we know about him? Well, we know that he's 33 years old and he's from Lemonster, Massachusetts. Investigators identified him as Francisco Severo Torres, and they say that Torres tried to tamper with the exit doors. He became belligerent towards the end of a nearly six hour flight from Los Angeles to Logan Airport here in Boston on Sunday. I will kill every man on this plane. So where are they? Where's Homeland Security? Now that was Torres captured on cell phone video by one of the passengers. Torres continued the threats as he moved from his seat to the aisle, holding what investigators say was a broken metal spoon. He then lunged at a flight attendant and allegedly attempted to stab that flight attendant three times in the neck before he was tackled. Very quickly, which was kind of the amazing part of the whole thing, um, so many men on that plane just got up and, you know, went right after him. Now, United Airlines re later released a statement saying that the flight landed safely and was met by law enforcement. No serious injuries were reported. We have zero tolerance for any type of violence on our flights, and this customer will be banned from flying on United pending an investigation. Now, according to court documents, Torres told investigators that he thought the flight attendant was trying to kill him, and that's why he tried to kill the flight attendant. Now, Torres has another hearing set for Thursday if he's committed convicted, he could face up to life in prison. Reporting live from Logan Airport in Boston, I'm Oscar Margain. Oscar, thank you. Now to another